have to discuss very important topic that is logarithmic differentiation. It is related to the differential calculus. So first of all, we have to discuss some properties of logarithmic functions. So these properties are if there are two numbers in multiplication log m n. So at same base that will be log m plus log n. Similarly, in place of division, there will be the log m minus log m separately. And similarly, log a base m power m base a that will be n log m power will come in starting logarithm of same number same base will be equal to 1 and logarithm of 1 at any base will be 0 there is also a rule of changing the base suppose we have log m base n so that will be written as log m base a upon log n base a it means same base will be allotted to both of the fractions now the questions which are asked they are related to the functions in which we have to take in the logarithm suppose we have y is x power x and we have to find dy upon dx so first of all we have to take the logarithm on both sides logarithm on w lete jab there is requirement of uh, this function in the power of function tabhi hame log ki zarurat padti hai so taking log log y that will be x log x by the property now differentiating with respect to x x ke respect mein jab differentiation karenge to here it is y to log ka differentiation kya hota 1 upon y and y with respect to x will be dy by dx here we have two functions so we have to use the product rule first function differentiation of second plus second function into differentiation of first and this will be cancelled out that will be 1 plus of log x and y will be cross multiplied in this side on RHS so dy by dx will come out y 1 plus log x and y will be replaced as original function so that will be x for x 1 plus log x so it is the solution now the second problem this question is also asked in long answer questions so here we have a problem that y is x for sin x plus sin x for cos x and we have to evaluate dy by dx so there are two functions to so let them u and v and same process will be repeated here as we have stated in previous question take u and v as separate functions and take the log on both sides there will be two functions and use the product rule and log u will come out 1 upon u du upon dx first and second functions first function differentiation of second plus second differentiation of first and by cross multiplying u we will get du upon dx it is the first part after that second function is sin x whole power cos x so take log on both sides so log we will come out cos x log sin x again differentiate with respect to x and the same result will come here will be also two functions first term differentiation of second plus second into differentiation of first and we will be cross multiplied in order to evaluate dv upon dx and finally these two results will be added when you will write your answer so in writing the answers these two results will be added and it will be your answer thanks for watching